Welcome. This is Paula Chafee Scardamalia of DivinningTheMuse.com with your Monday Tarot message from the Muse for the week of December 16th. Okay, your theme for the week is Five of Cups. Not a very happy looking card, is it? Cups, you remember, is the suit of uh, water, of heart, of feelings, emotions, dreams, intuitions, and creativity. And you can see this poor woman is sitting with her back to the wall, holding two cups, her arms are crossed um, protectively, and on the ground in front of her are three broken cups. So your theme for the week is to look at um, where you have two creative ideas or projects or opportunities that you aren't taking action on because the worry or fear of disappointment and failure is keeping you immobilized. So as you move through the week doing your work and living your life, look at where you are tending to protect yourself and protect your creative ideas by not taking action on them. Your focus for the week is the Three of Coins. Very different feeling and energy from the previous card. So your focus is to really, and he is very focused here. Remember, coins is the suit or element of earth, of anything material, um, home, health, money, anything you touch, taste, or feel. Obviously, this is the card of a craftsman. He's sitting here. He's got two coins hanging on the wall behind him and one in front of him on which he's etching and getting ready to inlay coins. So your focus this week is to focus on your work. Do the practical steps, the things you need to do for finishing and creating. And the action for the week is to be the page of coins. We're still in the element of earth here. This is all about making it real, manifesting it in a way that can be seen or tasted or heard or felt. Um, the page, of course, is the youthful one in the court. The page is the messenger. The page has the vitality and energy. So after you're done finishing this project, you've focused on it, you're finishing it, you've got something here, you want to share it with the world, you want to communicate about it. So put it out, put it out in the market. <clears throat> Excuse me, talk about it. <clears throat> and then finally, so we begin with cups and we end with cups. Just a two-suited reading today. Um, again, another page. So look for an opportunity to communicate it, not just get it out in the world, but to communicate what you do and who you are with passion and with real feeling. And it's possible that once you get this other project out into the world, that the universe in this form of or guise of a page brings you a new idea. So as we look at the story for the week, it's interesting because here we start from a place of protection and fear. Fear is keeping us immobilized. So what in your work is keeping you, what fear in your about your work and your ability to su succeed is keeping you with your back against the wall. Then focus on what is the project that needs the attention this week? What do I need to finish, do the final detail work on? Sometimes that's where we fall down on, on our work. We don't do the final polishing details that need to be done. And then get out there with your work promote it, share it, and finally communicate about it with heart and look for the universe to bring you that new idea, which is to reaffirm for you that there's no reason to sit here in fear that these two are, uh, ideas are the only thing you have. There's more where that came from. And this is Paula Chafee Scardamalia of DivinningTheMuse.com wishing you divine musings.